guys, I uh, just wanted to do a new video for you. Today's video is going to be my makeup collection. Um, I have never done one of these before and just kind of, you know, since I'm getting out there and getting started, just wanted to show you guys what I have to work with. Maybe get some of you interested in it as well and just to show you that you don't need a lot of makeup to do a video or to do a YouTube a Beauty Guru channel. Um, so this is just kind of show you some of the stuff that I have. Um, and so yeah, I can't wait to let you see my setup, my storage. Um, it is very, very, very plain compared to what you might see on other Beauty Guru channels right now. A lot of my stuff that I have gotten have come from like Target and Walmart. Um, so I don't have like the most high-end expensive stuff, but everything that I have really works for me at the stage that I am right now. I'm always continually looking for new ideas of what to do, uh, what to get to store um, your thing, uh, my things in. So yeah, like I said, this is uh, just my first collection video to show you guys out there what I have and what I'm starting with and possibly get you guys to let you know it doesn't take a lot of makeup to be able to do a channel, have fun with it, and do something that you're really passionate about. So let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> So here you can see when you walk into my room, my setup, it's like I said, very, very, very plain. There's not a lot to it. It's just a small desk right in the front of us. This desk I purchased at Walmart for $50. And then on our side we have, uh, two sides we have like a couple of bins, just three door bins that I bought again at Walmart. So we'll just go ahead and walk right in. This is in my spare bedroom, so it's nothing grandiose at all. So this is just kind of what we have here, what I'm working with to do this. So when we come right over here, this is the first chest of drawers that I have. And I purchased this at Walmart, I believe, for $10, so just a three big three-chested drawer. Um, on top right here I have my brushes that I don't use every day. These brushes are all from like e.l.f., MAC, and Eco Tools. Um, and I just got this thing. This is actually like a utensil holder. I got this at Target for $7. Um, next to it I just have my little iPod player I got at Kmart I think for like 50 bucks because I like to listen to music of course when I'm getting ready in the morning. So we'll just go down to the first drawer. In this first drawer that I have this is all of my face stuff. So we have my um, Mac eye, uh, eye remover, eye makeup remover. Um, and then just some little uh, cleansing stuff. This right here is my brush cleanser from MAC. Um, so in here is pretty much just like face cleansing, face towelettes, masks, stuff like that. And the second drawer down, what I have is this is all of my tanning stuff. So I have my Saint Tropez uh, tanning bronzer, my Saint Tropez um, self tan enhancer, just some bronzers that I have from Victoria's Secret, CVS Cocoa Butter, just because the uh, self tanners do dry your skin out. Um, and the third drawer down, this is where I keep all of my eyelashes um, and just some uh, different stuff um, like my uh, sugar, uh, Shea Sugar Body Scrub. These are all of my eyelashes that I have from MAC and Urban Decay. And then just some EOS. Um, I have a backup of these. These are really great. They're just small little EOS hand lotions to uh, put in your purse. So I have backup of those. And then just my little eyeshadow uh, depods um, that I got from Urban Decay. So that is what I have in my third drawer. Then when we come up to the side, I have my um, tripods just sitting on there. So this is only sitting on there when I'm doing uh, when I'm doing videos. I got my tripod um, at Kmart again for twenty four dollars. So I'm just going to stick that to the side. Um, this mirror that I got, I got this mirror at. Uh, Walmart um, and it's just a little accent mirror and I got this mirror for like ten uh, for like ten dollars um, so really good mirror it's big you can see everything um, so then coming over here this is just my brushes that I use every day so my Mac Sedona Lace and Sigma face brushes um, I got this holder it actually I got this in the um, Walmart office supply aisle and I got this for three dollars then I just have my um, Urban Decay setting spray that I keep up here as well as my little e.l.f. Kabuki brush. Really great brush, soft. Um, hair product and then just some hand lotion that I like to use. 
And then when we come over here, this is just a, um, a self-made box. This is actually, I got a necklace and a bracelet set from Juicy Couture. And in here, I just hold like my um, bobby pins and my tweezers and my little scissors for when I do my eyebrows. This is just a, lip, a little sample of It's Potent by um, Benefit Eye Cream that I got. Then when you come up here, this is another little office set that I got from Target. Um, what this is, is it's just a little, um, like a file holder that you ha can use. And I have my Naked uh, Naked 2 and my Naked 1 palettes in here. Um, so it's really easy to stick in there. So that's where I have those. Then I also have my MAC palettes that I have in there. I have three MAC palettes and this is where I stick my MAC palettes at. So this is really nice. I got this as well for $3 at Target in their home office area. And then in the side I just stick on my EOS, um, let's see here if I can get light. These are the EOS lip balms. These are really great. So I have three of those in there and then I have my e.l.f. conditioning lip balm in let's see here, and nice and natural. Um, so that sticks in there as well as my eyelash curler. So that's where I have my palettes at. Next to it I just have my Jergens Natural Glow Daily Moisturizer. Uh, and then I have my Eyes, Lips, Face ta um, palette that I have as well um, next to it. Over on the side here, I have another tower of chest of drawers that I got, and I got these chest of drawers, let's see here, um, at Target as well. Um, so in each of these chest of drawers, my top one, this is all of my MAC lipsticks that I have. So these all go in this drawer right here. Um, so if you guys want to see like a more in-depth of what like all my makeup consists of and just different things I have I'll do but right now I'm just kind of showing you what my makeup collection looks like and the storage in this next chest of drawers these are all of my these are all of my Mac lip glosses that I have in different uh, shades and colors in the next drawer down this is where I keep all of my lipsticks that are not uh, Mac um, so these are like my Benefit, Victoria's Secret, and my Lip Butters and NYX. And then we have the next set of drawers. These are going to be all of my lip glosses that are not MAC. And then just some uh, MAC lip, uh, lip pencils that I have. Then in the next set of drawers that I have, this is going to be all of my eye primers and my um, eye tattoo uh, studios by Lori, or excuse me, by Maybelline. So these are um, where all these go, all of my primers. Um, I have Urban Decay, MAC, Benefit, um, and NYX. So that's where this is. So this is all of my um, eyelid primers. Then by the next drawer down, I have all of my eyeshadows that are not in palettes. So I have my MAC eyeshadows, um, I also have my Urban Decay shadows, and then I have just small palettes by MAC, Maybelline, and then this one by back here by Wet n Wild. Um, th the way that I do my uh, drawers is I kind of do them in order. They're kind of upside down right now. Um, but as far as like how I sit and what's more accessible to me is how I do it. So like my eyelid primers, sorry I can't get that drawer in. Like my eye eyelid primers would go first before my eyeshadows. Then you have my eyeshadows. Um, then I have my eye pigments. Um, so these are all my MAC and NYX eye pigments that I have. And then after that, then I would go and do my eyebrows. So I have all of my eyebrow stuff. I have my um, eye stencils. Sorry, they're kind of dirty. My um, concealer for when I want to do a real uh, intense brow. And then just my brow stuff that I use by Maybelline and e.l.f. Then in the very uh, last drawer on my shelf that I have, this is where all of my um, my eyeliners, my fluid tracks by um, MAC, black tracks, um, my liquid uh, sparkly eyeliners by Urban Decay, and all of my mascaras go in this one. So that's how I have the, my uh, chest of drawers set up there, is just by what goes first. My lip, um, this is just also another palette that I have sitting right here, my Urban Decay that I had done in my Urban Decay and MAC haul. 
So then coming over right here, we have this little um, mirror that we got. And I got this mirror at Target, and the light, um, the light around here turns on. And I use that for when I'm, like, plucking eyebrows or doing, you know, something more intense. And this light comes on. And then on the other side of it, you have a, a higher resolution magnifying mirror. Then I just have a little candle. And then when we come down here, I have two more uh, sets of uh, uh, chests. And again, I got these at Target. And so in these chests of drawers right here, this is going to be my um, primer drawers. So I have my Strobe Cream by MAC, my Urban Decay Tinted Moisturizer for when I don't want to uh, do a heavy uh, day of makeup. So that's what I have in that drawer. And again, these are all in, put in order as to what I would use first and what I would use last. So then right here is where going to be my chest of drawers that has all of my foundation in it. So I have my MAC foundation lighter color for when I'm lighter. I have a MAC foundation darker for when I'm more tan. Um, I also have my high beams and I have my pearl or luster drops by MAC. Those you add into your foundation just to give you that more dewy glow. Um, and then I have powder foundation that I would put over. This one's by Urban Decay Hallucination. And I would put this on over my tinted moisturizer for, again, when I don't want a really heavy, heavy set makeup day. Next up for that, I have all my setting powders. And these are all my setting powders from uh, MAC and e.l.f., uh, my Prep and Prime, my Studio Fix. So these are all of my, uh, my powder foundations and setting powders that I use. Then coming to the next chest of drawers down, these are all my concealers. I'm a big concealer junkie. So I have Glamouflage by Hard Candy, Laura Mercier, um, my e.l.f. I have Hard Candy again. So this is where I keep all my concealers. I like to put my concealer on after I do my foundation because I usually do a concealer lighter than what I normally wear because I like that highlighted look under my eyes. Next down here is going to be all of my bronzing and contouring stuff. Um, so that's where I keep these at. MAC, Maybelline, Rimmel, Benefit. Um, so that's where this drawer is. Then the next set of drawers and the last one on this side is going to be all of my MAC um, blushes that I have. Over here is just a little um, MAC bag. This is what I use for just my garbage. Easy. So then from the set of this chest of drawers, this is going to be another one, and this is the last one that I have. Right here, and the first one is going to be more blushes. This is going to be stuff that is not MAC. So um, I do have my blushes and highlighters in here. So with this one, I have um, my highlighters. This is Gold Deposit by MAC, San Tropez Skin Illuminator, and then I also have just my Benefit, e.l.f., and NARS. So these are next one down. These are going to be just my um, MAC palettes that I don't use and I use that to mix up my foundation on so that's why those are dirty. And then in the next one down these are going to be where I keep all of my nail polishes at. So that is my setup. Like I said it's not very grand. It's not very big. Not very expensive. Everything is very 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 affordable. So yeah, I got most of my stuff again, like I said, at Target and Walmart. I got this desk, which I really like, and this desk was only $50. So yeah, that's my setup. So there you have it, my setup and my makeup collection. It's not big at all, and like I said, you don't need a lot of makeup or a huge grando thing to be able to do what you really want to do and what you're passionate about. So again, like I said, everything I got was at Target or Walmart, not very expensive whatsoever. Um, and then I've just, from here and there, as far as what I want in my collection, I've just learned from people off of YouTube or just going to, you know, the Benefit Urban Decay or MAC counters and asking them what's hot for this season, what sells a lot. So that's how I've gotten to do my collection, just by asking and watching other people. So I just want to say thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you have any questions about where I got stuff or how I store stuff, don't forget to leave comments. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There will be more videos to come. And I just really, really, again, want to say thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video.